Welcome back. In this video, I will discuss utility based agents in artificial intelligence. As discussed earlier, there are mainly four types of agents in artificial intelligence simple reflex agents, model based reflex agents, goal based, and utility based agents in artificial intelligence. I have already discussed simple reflex agent, model based reflex agent, and goal based reflex agent. Link for those videos is given in the description below. In this video, I will discuss uh, utility based agents. Utility based agents are similar to the goal based agents, but they will add an extra component that is known as utility or performance measurement, which makes them different from goal based AI agent by providing the measure of success at a given state. That means whenever we are present at a particular state, in goal based agent, what we do is uh, out of uh, different uh, possible paths, we will select a path which will lead us to goal. We don't consider whether that particular path is uh, best at that given point of time. But in utility based agent, definitely we will select one path which will lead us to goal. Along with that, we will select a best path. That means the one which will lead us to goal with minimum cost. So the utility based agent is useful when there are multiple possible alternatives are there. For example, you are present in a particular state, there are multiple number of options are there. Within these options, we need to select one option. In goal based agent, what we do is we will select an option which will lead us to goal. That is what we do. Let's assume that there are multiple number of options are there which will lead us to goal. In that case, uh, the goal based agents uh, will get confused which one to select and all. But in a utility based agent, what it does is out of these uh, possibilities, they will select an option which will lead us to this goal with minimum cost or you can say that the one path which will perform well. So that particular action will be selected in this case. So what utility based uh, agents will do is uh, they will map each of these particular uh, paths with uh, some real number. Uh, for example, uh, the one for this one or uh, two for this one, 0.5 for this one. If we consider this is the cost, this will be the best option over here because it is having minimum cost to reach this goal node here. So based on these real numbers, they will select an action which will lead us to goal with minimum cost in this case. Now some of the examples for utility based agents are recommendation systems. In this case, uh, the AI systems or the AI agents will recommend products, movies or music to the users based on the predicted utility scores of each of the users. For example, a particular person is uh, very much interested in a certain number of products. Uh, those products will be recommended because the utility score for those products will be more in that case. Uh, like uh, a person is interested in uh, electronics gadgets. So the electronics gadgets uh, utility score will be more. So the electronics gadgets will be recommended to that user. Similarly, if a particular person is interested in a certain kind of uh, movies, for those movies, uh, the utility score will be more. So such kind of movies will be recommended and so on. Similarly, in uh, trading robots or uh, trading agents, these uh, agents will evaluate the investment options and the trading decisions. And uh, they will uh, give the suggestions uh, based on the return on investment, the one which will give maximum return on investment. Such kind of options will be given to the users in this case. Now we will discuss some of the strengths of utility based agent. These AI agents are flexible and adaptive. That is, they will learn from the past experiences that will be stored into an internal model. They will select an action which will lead us to goal. And they use the utility function. That is the action which will lead us to goal with minimum cost that will be selected in this case. While doing all these things, they will consider the risk, time and effort. And based on these things, uh, they will select an action uh, which will lead us to goal with minimum cost in this case. Coming back to the weaknesses, uh, designing utility function is uh, complex. They are computationally expensive also. And evaluating the utility of all possible outcomes is uh, computationally expensive in this case. There is a degree of uncertainty about the outcomes. In this video, I have discussed what are utility based agents in artificial intelligence how they work and what are the strengths and weaknesses of utility based AI agents in artificial intelligence. I hope the concept is clear. If you like the video, do like and share with your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates.
Thank you for watching.